A segue is an inverted pendulum, which means that its center of mass is above its pivot point. If the rider leans forwards or backwards, the wheels will move accordingly in order to catch up with the rider's center of mass. So the greater the lean in either direction, the higher the speed. That's all very well, but any variations in surface can affect the traction of the tires. If it loses too much traction, the Segway can't accelerate fast enough to keep up with the rider's center of mass. And if you're traveling faster than your Segway, you're going to end up going head over wheels. Wheels. If you're traveling forward at speed, a slight lean backwards will act as a brake to slow you down. Here's a demo. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's crushing. Sorry. After he's fallen off, he pulls the controls back. And so the Segway thinks he's trying to reverse and duly obliges. 